Ooh. Be there or be square? I spent a hundred of bug reports. I told that idiot this would happen. Overlapping scripts. More than one AI was bound to be spawned into an environment at some point. Turns out I missed the point. That little error changed everything. Interesting. Chris took an immediate and deep dislike to the skinny red rectangle. Who the hell did this Thomas think he was? <laughs> Oh, okay, so this guy's name is Chris or something? He really can't jump very high. So, like, he's a strictly worse Thomas or something? Oh my. Chris had been doing fine. He wasn't the highest jumper, but he'd held his own. He'd even been graceful at times. Yeah. Not actually... Not technically graceful. It's probably, probably the wrong word, but, you know... Fine. There was that skinny little runt leaping about like he owned the place. Can I, can I even get over this jump? No, I need Thomas. Thomas, where are you, good sir? Oh my. Oh wow. Did this just spawn? Do they go away if I leave it? Or what? <laughs> I like this. Oh, jeez. <laughs> oh, God, my face. <laughs> Alright. There you go. Here you go, Chris. Get your get your butt over there. Wait a minute. Do I, do I still need Chris? I don't think I still need Chris. No, I can jump over this. Easy. Alright, Chris, let's go. Move your... Move your... Waddling face over here. Into the square. Yar. One, three. Okay. This was more like it. A glowy white thing. Only Chris could get to it. Which, of course, made it all the more enticing. What would it do? What new opportunity might this switch open up to him? Fancy. Okay, so he ne still needs Thomas's help to get up everywhere. Yeah, even there. Yeah, oh, Thomas, get off of him. Great, great. Another chance for Thomas to jump slightly higher than Chris. How fortunate. Seriously, this made the whole switch pressing thing entirely worthwhile. <laughs> Clearly, Chris is not pleased by this. So this is like kind of introducing us to the whole switching mechanic, which I'm sure we'll see a lot more of. Was this good? Because on the surface, it did not seem good. Chris was pretty scared. Little Red seemed fine, happy to be on his merry little adventure. <laughs> Chris couldn't shake the feeling that things had taken a significant turn for the worse since Thomas had joined him. Hmm. Sure, he'd been able to piggyback his way to ever so slightly higher platforms, but where had that got him? Well, to ever so slightly higher platforms, which was sort of his point. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, no. Oh. oh, okay. That's supposed to happen. <laughs> right, Chris, let's go. Can he, can he make it? Yeah, he can make it across these platforms. No problem. Like a champ. Like a champ. All right. Thomas gets the uh, slightly wider gaps. Miss time my jumps. Miss time that jump. I keep mistiming this jump. Why? <laughs> Maybe it's because I'm not supposed to be jumping from here. I'm supposed to jump from here. Boing. Bo nope. <laughs> Curses. Okay, Thomas, you jump and move too fast for your own good. There we go. Trial and error. <laughs> oh jeez. Okay. Moving on to the next part. Chris stared at Thomas with pure hatred. He seemed so very happy at their situation. Friends together. A brave fellowship of quadrilaterals on a quest for greatness. 
<laughs> that would be fine. But it was all the obvious observation that Thomas was doing which grated. Every time they saw something vaguely new, Chris would hear a satisfied little hmm from the vaulting idiot. Oh dear. He hoped the next portal would split them up. If only for a few levels. <laughs> Alright, so I need to hit this first. Ah, it turned into a moving platform. Okay, that makes sense. Alright, Chris, get on this side, because I want you to get over there first. There we go. Chris make it? Yes, he can. Just barely. Alright, so clearly, Chris is meant to go... ...under. Ah, little staircase. Boink, and a boink, and a boink, and a boink, and a, oh, what? Oh, okay, Thomas is supposed to go all the way around. And I missed my chance. Curses! It's okay, it's all a waiting game. The music is nice to listen to anyway. Ah. I really like the simplistic, uh, graphics. Even though I, I did put it up to fantastic, but I mean, it still looks really simplistic, and I like that. And the music. Again, I can't, I can't not comment on, oh, new character. John knew. He knew that this was his chance. A moment to shine. This was game day. So, new character, John? John the... Very tall rectangle. <laughs> Do this. And there we go. Alright. So then. This would not do. John needed room to show off his exceptional skills. As it was, he was trapped on the wrong side of these little dot things. <laughs> little dot things. Where they come from anyway? <laughs> I like this. Okay, so I can really feel it. Chris is slower. Chris is slow and can't jump as high. Now we have Thomas who's like the middleman. This John guy. I'm guessing he can jump really high because he's a freaking long rectangle. But, I don't know. John inhaled the air of the open space, and it smelled of awesome. <laughs> time to flex those muscles, to put his training to use time to show those little dots how it was done. Bang! I have a feeling that only John can do that. Hid? Well, if I don't mess up that jump. Hid? Yep. Oh, okay, so he's the only one who can make these jumps. Nice. John decided to press the switch to let the little dots catch up with him. John cared for his new allies. Ha! <laughs> you could tell from the sympathetic expression he'd practiced in the mirror all these years. <laughs> oh, collectible! Oh, I need I need Thomas for this. Thomas, get over here! Your friend Chris needs some help. And by friend, I'm using like air quotes, but not really, because I still need to play the game. <laughs> there I go. Ah, oh, no. I need to learn to press the right keys. There we go. Alright, so I saw some collectibles. Let's go ahead with Thomas. Because Thomas was alone. I feel like I need like a combination of all three of these guys to get that collectible. Unless I can just kind of cheat. Okay, never mind. <laughs> Friggin' <laughs> John can get it himself. Alright. Chris, why are you so slow? Whoa. <laughs> kind of bounced off. Jeez. Okay, so clearly. Chris can go through that tiny little gap. Hit, 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 okay. And then time for Thomas. Thomas needs Chris 
<laughs> wow. Okay. Or maybe he needs John. Oh, he needs John. Wow. Okay. Well, duh, geez. Boink. Come here, Thomas. Get over there. All right. There you go. All being great pals. Feeling that John can't make it up there himself. Oh, John just was happy to keep helping. He felt it was important to his image that he was seen to help the little guys. Can Thomas make it through that? Yes, he can. Okay. John can't, so that's why they opened up a little tiny slot. Okay. Nice, simple little designs. I like this. Uh, let's do this. I don't know how to think about this. I'm gonna do... First I need this. I need Chris to get on top first. Then... Do that for that. Yeah, alright. Still can't quite make it. Jeez. Whoops. <laughs> Okay, there we go. Alright. I finally make it up. I'm feeling I have to do this. For Chris. There we go. Okay. Oh, geez, lots of staircase building. Just for Chris. You should feel special. Ugh. Chris is such a hindrance. That's okay. Because everyone's different. I need John for that. <laughs> I got more staircase building. <laughs> okay. Uh, 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 uh. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Kinda. He didn't mind them so much either. The red one, Thomas, had a charming way of applauding every time John jumped. <laughs> oh jeez, they bounced. <laughs> oh my. Boink. Boink. Oh no, we're moving up. That's why. I'm actually gonna move Chris on top. Huh? Huh? There we go. No. Well, yeah, might as well set this up for when Chris gets here. All right, Chris. Time for more step ladders. Whoops. Wrong thing. There we go. Uh, there is a collectible. The angry orange one was less immediately likable, but his unremitting cynicism and tutting amused John. <laughs> I, I wonder... Actually, hold on a second. Get down here, both of you. They're gonna help John get this chip. Oh, wow, I still can't. That was silly. How do you get that? I wonder. Uh, not quite, not quite. Oh dear, I jumped off. <laughs> ah. Such re relaxing music, even when you screw up, it doesn't matter, because it's so nice to listen to. There we go. They seek it here, they seek it there. Alright, neato, neato, okay. Time to make that staircase again. Again, Thomas. Open Chris a bit. Hoppa. Hoppa. And then, need John again. Thomas over there. Hop, 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 ho! 
Oh wait, I think I need... There we go. I don't think Chris can make this, can he? No, he just barely can't. There we go. Wow, that's kind of weird, but okay, I'll take it. No, let's not move Thomas all the way back down. And boop, and bam! Alright. 110. This was interesting. A floating target. This would require coordination, balance, and timing. John was sure the dots would be lost, but he was happy to guide them to triumph. Chris, I think, needs the help of John to be able to cross these gaps. Ah, I see where this is going. Okay, so... Maybe that's what the dots were for. They were there to extend John's reach, to make his performance even more impressive. John liked the thought. He decided to keep them. <laughs> he decided to keep them? Okay. <laughs> uh, yeah, there we go. Alright, so, got to move them all into position. Here, and Chris can go over here real easily. Alright, and now time to move Thomas, and bam! Alright, 